is Derek. And my name is Steven. And we'll be your anchors today. Today's date is September 8th, 2022. This week's character counts quote is from Marcus Aurelius and they said if it's not right, don't do it. If it's not true, don't say it. Simple. Do you know what the bald eagle symbolizes? America. Let's do the pledge. Please stand. Place your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, Up next is the daily news. The idea of, you know, posting and having a lot of people see it can definitely be kind of scary. You know, if you're a teenager, you're going to make bad decisions sometimes. They can screenshot it, they can do so many things to save that, and they can edit it in ways that you won't want them to. Whether or not you think it'll go away, it's there. Anything you post online, you're stuck with. Oversharing to me is putting too much of your personal life in front of a, a wide audience of people. Posting something for the sake of showing that you're there and maybe not because you're actually having that great of a time. Posting about things that people don't necessarily think are significant, but they're just kind of posting to be posting. What you share and how often you share is gonna affect the way that somebody views you. Just because I'm gonna post all the time and that doesn't mean that you're going to get all the attention. That doesn't mean that everybody's going to like you. For example, people have like Finstas where they, or spam accounts where they just like post random stuff and sometimes they get too personal with what, uh, with what they're talking about on there. Things that are meant to be texted one to one, people tend to post online so 50 other people can see their plans for tomorrow or the next weekend. You could be doing something like that could potentially endanger yourself by making your account public and saying too much about where you live or who you are. When I'm in like a cool location and I want to show everybody where I am, but most of the time I'll just tag where I am on like a Snapchat story so people can know. So once you put something online, it can be there forever because people might take screenshots, they might record it, they might save it. I don't think I don't think people don't realize that it's going to be there forever. I think they just don't care. A lot of people have this mentality of like, what I'm doing is very insignificant. Why is anyone going to care about this? You should be cautious of what you post. You don't post your pictures and think like, OK, nobody, nobody's seeing me, nobody's screenshotting me, nobody doing nothing, because people doing that, you just not going to know. Uh, your Snapchats, despite the fact that they only last, I don't know, four to eight seconds, they're still there. Your Instagram stories that go away after 24 hours, they're still there. Anything that is posted, anything that's up, no matter what happens, even if you leave it up for a minute and take it down, it's there as, as soon as you put it up there. No one's going to scrutinize everything that you say the same way that you might. You are not obliged to post every second of your life in order to please um, what you might seem as the majority of people. So when you feel like you have to post all the time, when you feel like you have to do this in order to get fame and attention, you don't. It's not your job. That's something you always have to be thinking about. Um, what do you want people to remember you on social media as? Once again, my name is Derek. And my name is Steven. And today's date is September 8th, 2022. This week's character counts quote is from Marcus Aurelius. And they said, if it's not right, don't do it. If it's not true, don't say it. All right, Spartans, don't forget to read, lead, and succeed. And we'll see you next time.